Let's have some beer. What be going down, people of the world? Thank you so much for joining me for yet another Daily Drink vlog. My name is Redbeard, and for the beer of the today, we have got a can of Starry Night, Starry Night, Starry Night Chocolate Stout by the Bob Cajun Brewing Company out of Bob Cajun, Ontario? I would assume. Yes, Bob Cajun, Ontario. Coming in at 6.3% ABV. Chocolate Stout. One of those styles I find, it lies quite often. It'll say chocolate stout, but the chocolate will not be there or be there in such little quantity that it doesn't seem like a chocolate stout. It just seems like a stout. So, give it the benefit of the doubt, and we'll hope that this is a chocolate stout. As we crack it open, and we see what we have got. It's got that typical stout blackness going on get some actual head would be nice come on you can do it there we go get a picture before it disappears she's pretty dark with some light behind it and um no light coming through whatsoever all right then she's a dark astauta doesn't really have any coffee in the aroma to speak of but it doesn't smell bad it smells like a nice stout sweet malty let's give her a shot that's not bad there's actually a decent amount of chocolate in the flavor A little bit of like a metallic taste or something as well. In the finish. Kind of throws it off a little bit. but Maybe it's just my palate being a little bit of a weirdo. Let's do this. Cheers, everybody. not bad there's just that I don't know how old it is what do we got here this is a November of last year so the six percent stout it should still be completely acceptable like November December January February March April that's fine with a stout stouts are able to sit around for a while there's no hoppy presence that's gonna fade I'm wondering if the chocolate might be a bit more pronounced if it was more fresh or that weird flavor might be gone. I don't know. It's all right. I was thinking, I know I've had a couple other beers by this brewery. And they are the Dockside Red was enjoyed, Common Loon American Pale Ale. Didn't not like that one. I felt like there was something else, but I guess not. Hmm. I don't know. I'm pretty sure all the cans <clears throat> say this exact same thing. Bob Cajun Brewing Company was founded with one goal in mind, to brew great craft beers to be enjoyed among friends. That's it, nothing more, nothing less. Yeah, so. Ingredients, water, barley malt, lactose, hops, cacao nibs, and yeast. Excuse me. No offensive flavors there. Uh, Bob Cajun Brewing. Ca will bring bring will bring will bring it a bit of bing, 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 bring you to Bob Cajun Brewing. Ca, and if you're in the Bob Cajun area, which uh, in Ontario, I'm not really sure where in Ontario though. I've never been there, or anywhere near there. <clears throat> I've never seen like a street a sign on the highway saying, "Take this exit to go to Bob Cajun." 
I don't think. Now I'm curious. That is not what I want to do at all. Probably go to the actual red one. Bob Cajun, Ontario. Give me my map. Where'd my damn mouse go? My evil mouse that likes to disappear. Zoom out. Zoom out some more. Zoom out some more. I have never been anywhere near Bob Cajun. It's in the Kawartha Lakes region, which is kind of east of Barrie a little bit, I guess. So southeastern Ontario. Although not really that east because it's like not even halfway to Ottawa between Toronto and Ottawa. I can't describe things accurately. Welcome to my channel. Where it happens with stuff like that, beer, whatever I'm talking about. Don't know what I'm talking about. This is pretty good though. That odd flavors kind of mellowed out a little bit. Definitely not getting as much of an offensive weirdness to it. Just got a nice chocolatey flavor to it overall. Honestly, probably one of the better chocolate Jesus chocolate stouts I've had. Now I'm curious about that. What if I search for chocolate on my channel? Chocolate. Big Rig. Midnight Kiss My Cow. Double chocolate milk stout. Wasn't overly impressed with that one. Flying Monkey's Chocolate Manifesto. That is a good one. Uh, Wellington Chocolate Milk Stout. I think I didn't, that one was decent. Um, double chocolate stout by uh, Young's. Aurora Heart chocolate raspberry stout by Flying Monkeys, also pretty tasty. The Radical Road Midnight Oil Imperial Chocolate Oatmeal Stout that was sent to me by uh, someone whose name I wanna say Sean the Beer Guy or something. That was not that chocolatey. And that's about it for chocolate stuff. So there's been a decent amount of chocolate beer had on the channel. This is one of the better ones that... The two Flying Monkey ones are the best ones I've had by far. I believe that was actually had last year on my sister's birthday. February... <clears throat> something. <laughs> I can never remember the damn date of it. I'm gonna say 23rd or something. I don't know. I'm an, I'm an, I'm an awesome brother. <laughs> Terrible. Been recording for 10 minutes and 25 seconds now. So I'm gonna take a little break. <laughs> yeah, the camera did move just a little bit because I realized it wasn't in the right place the entire first portion of the vlog. Genius right here. Really decent <clears throat> chocolate stout right here. Like I said several times. It's not <clears throat> amazing or anything, but it's, it's really nice, drinkable, palatable, whatever you might want to call it. Untapped rating. 3.71 out of 5 with 904 ratings overall. Beer Advocate, we've got 3.93 out of 5 with 5 ratings overall. And Rate Beer gives it a 3.19 out of 5 with 13 ratings overall. So it's enjoyed, I'd say, pretty much as much as I'm enjoying it right now by most individuals out there. Drink number for last. Bob Cajun Brewing Company. Your Starry Night Chocolate Stout rating. Like an 8.75, somewhere in that range. It's really nice. Because that beginning was kind of weird. 
If it wasn't kind of weird, it'd probably be like a nine and a half maybe, but 8.75 is where I'm gonna where I'm gonna leave that one for now. Because that's what I want to do. And that's gonna do it for today's Daily Drink vlog. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, a little thumbs up action, always appreciated. Want to see more? Subscribe, bell notification, what's gonna call it? Shits and uh ding ding, so you could be notified when I go live playing the video games. And you got something else to say to me? Comments go in the box down below. Thanks again, and I'll be back with another Dota vlog tomorrow. A uh, peace out! Randomly came across this along with like seven or eight other new beers when I did my LCBO tour that I do every couple weeks to see what's around, kind of thing. So, we got new beers.